question eight is asking us to find out which two lines are parallel. So essentially all we have to do here is solve each of them for y and determine what the slope is. And since we're looking for parallel lines, I'm looking for two lines that have the same slope. So for number one, I have 2y equals negative 3x minus 4. To get y by itself, so that it's in slope-intercept form, I need to divide all of my terms by 2. So I end up with y equals negative 3 over 2x minus 2, since 4 divided by 2 is 2. And then all I'm looking at is the number next to x. So my answer for number 1, my slope is negative 3 over 2. Now I need to do the same thing for number 2. I have 2y equals 3 plus 6x. This one looks a little funny because usually the x term is first. It actually doesn't matter as long as you know that when you're looking for your slope, it's the number in front of x. So I'm going to do the same thing and divide by 2. So I end up with y equals 3 over 2 plus 6 divided by 2 is just 3. So I'm going to write plus 3x. Now again, I'm looking at the number next to x, so I have a 3. And then last but not least, number 3, I have 2y minus 6x equals negative 4. This one's going to be the most work um, because I have to move my x term before I can divide, before I can divide. So I'm going to add 6x to both sides. And I end up with 2y equals 6x minus 4. And now I'm going to go and divide everything by 2. So my final equation would be 3x minus 2. So again, I'm looking at the number in front of x. So the slope is 3. So now since I'm looking to see which ones are parallel, um, I'm picking the ones that are the same. So that would be lines 2 and 3. So my final answer is 2 and 3.